Hey guys, Rocketblade here once again. What is up, everybody? Um, this video is gonna again piss people off, but it's the truth needs to be said. Um, of course, everyone knows about a game called No Man's Sky. It's been hyped. Everyone's saying it's gonna be the next big, you know, Halo or Half Life. Or Gears of War, the next big game that everyone's going to be talking about for years to come. I mean, I heard nothing but hype and excitement for this game. But so much negative, crazy, and just stupid behavior f from some fans. Not all fans, but some fans. That it's just like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? Let me go through the history of these crazy events. So... Um, the first one being, uh, Kotaku, one of the people, one of the writers from Kotaku said that unfortunately, No Man's Sky will be delayed. He's just doing his job, that's what he, he's just, he's just heard rumors that that might happen, so he's just, you know, he's the one to put that out there, that it's just, it's just a rumors I've been confirmed, he's just, you know, he's, he's just one, this is what he's hearing from sources. So the people, um, fans of him start giving him death threats. Death threats. I'm not kidding, guys. Death threats for a guy that's just doing his job. And it's just rumors. It's not even been confirmed yet. Selling him death threats. How they're going to kill him and shit. I'm like, guys, like, fucking. I'm like, I've never seen this before. I'm like, oh, I'm like, I'm like dudes, like, let's calm our shits, man. It's just a delay. It's not going to be. It's just a rumor. It's not even. It's not even, it hasn't even been confirmed yet. So why are we losing our shit? So then later on, um, one of the. People working at Happy Games, you know, one of the people, aka the people that are making people, the people that are making No Man's Sky, um, confirmed on Twitter that yes, the game has been delayed for two months. So instead of you know, so not knowing what you're thinking, well, did they apologize to Kotaku die and and understand um, all of the and you know apologize to Kotaku and uh, did, they, did they apologize to the Kotaku guy and 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 are willing to be patient? No. The, then the next thing that happened, they started doing death threats against the worker himself. Which, that also makes no fucking sense. But I'll say this first. It was delayed uh, once, for, you know, and people will understand that. People are understanding, okay, it makes sense, alright. But when it got delayed again, people just start losing their shits. Threatening a Kotaku worker, threatening the people from Happy Games that are making the game themselves. I mean, really, guys? I, I really even did a video on that. Um, and so then, the game, so then, finally the game comes out. It's August, it came out, and it, when, I, when I'm hanging around the internet, it's been very, very mixed. So people either really love it, or really hate it. It's, 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 it has the Batman vs. Superman syndrome. There's no, I haven't found no middle ground. Right? Is there any people that, there's, there's, either, there's either A, people that love it, or B, people that hate it. And, not for nothing, and this is where it gets real, and this is where it takes a turn for the worse, because the people that like this game are attacking anybody that is giving, that's giving it negative criticism. I mean, anybody. It's It's been insane. Case in point, um, what was it? Jim Sterling, a.k.a. Uh, the, the, the Jim Quisition, um, uh, fellow big man uh, like myself, he uh, is a great, he's a, he's a YouTuber, great guy, great, he does great content, and um, you should definitely check out his channel, great guy. He put a review of the game. He said it was mediocre, it wasn't to the stakes. He said, hey man, but he's like, hey, if you enjoy the game, if you, if you, if you enjoyed the game and, um, and got your money's worth, then God bless you. But for him, he thought it was mediocre at best, you know. It wasn't bad, but it was just mostly kind of boring. And not only they lashed out and attacked him, but he had a, a website called uh, he had a website where he had the review up, and they DDoS attacked his website, so it was down for the whole day. Thankfully, he doesn't get money from that. He gets money from his Patreon, so he didn't lose any money. But really, guys, because he gave an opinion... We're attacking a website? What the fuck is wrong with you guys? You got, seriously, Jesus Christ, there's more pressing things happening right now in America than the worry about some guys that be on a game. 
Look, I look. I'm a like for example. I'm a I'm a DC comic fan. You guys know that from my videos of reviewing the movies and enjoying what I've seen so far. But you know, you know, these DC fans want to do a petition to get rid of Rotten Tomatoes. I even spoken out against that, saying that's dumb because it's free. Because then the you're silencing freedom of speech. Granted, I said Rotten Tomatoes is stupid and pointless. In my opinion, is just to ignore, ignore, and pretend it doesn't it, and pretend it doesn't exist. But signing a petition to get rid of it is is taking away your freedom of speech, and that's not good at all for anybody. Like I said before, so. Same thing here. It's just an opinion, guys. And like anybody that attacks it is just getting criticized and DOS attacked or just getting just thumbs down. It's like it's in it's like a madhouse. It's kinda like like the the, the Dark Knight from a standpoint that like you can't say nothing negative about it or you just get just 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 wailed on by people. Just from comments and, 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 and stuff like that. So I'm like, to all you not all you, but but to all you uh, no Man's Sky people that are acting uh, out like this you need to grow the fuck up. Grow the fuck up. If you like the game so much, who gives a fuck what people say? Fuck them. Enjoy your game. Spread the word. In fact, show videos. Talk about it on Reddit sp or, or Facebook and Twitter. Spread the word on how the game is amazing and fun. Hey, do um counter videos. You know, like I did with my number nine saying how it's not a bad game. It's not a bad game. It's actually a good game. I did a counter video, but I just don't, you know, you know, threaten people's lives or take down their websites because I disagree, I disagree with their opinion. No, you know what I'm saying? That's stupid. You guys need to grow up, man. We, you know, it, it, it's just a fucking game. And if you guys love it so much, why are you on like on the internet looking for negative comments and or and attacking them? Why it's instead why it is I don't know. Here's a crazy idea. Play the fucking game. Just play the fucking game. If it if, if you love it so much, just play it. Who gives a fuck what people say? Like I said before, if if you feel that's a great game, make videos about it. Discuss it. Talk about how it's a great game and why people should try it. But for what I've seen like, oh it's a great game. It's, it's this great game, but yeah, I've seen people nothing but just attacking people. Because I have a different opinion than them. And just and that's, that's the thing I hate. If you disagree with someone, that's fine. But what, what gets me upset, really grinds my gears, as they say, is when, like, for example, I said that Batman vs. Instruments is one of the best, not one of the best DC movies ever made, in my opinion, but one of the best movies of the year so far, second place being Civil War. People just lose their shits against me and start... Saying how I'm dumb or stupid and, and piece of shit. First of all, fuck you. It's my opinion. If you don't like it, you can shut up your ass. I don't give a fuck. It's just an opinion. That's all it is. It's you know what I'm saying. If you don't like it, that's fine. Just say you just respectfully disagree, and you know I'll, I'll probably maybe say okay, what do you didn't like about it, and have a civil conversation. But don't like fucking insult me for liking something. You know what I'm saying. You know. It's like, for example, if you guys like My Little Pony, I'm not a judge and say, well, you're a faggot for liking My Little Pony. Hey, if you like it, and you find a drum out, if you find a drum out of it, you do you, boo-boo. You do you. I mean, I don't care I don't care for it. To me, it's just a show that's for little girls. But you get my point. Like, don't judge other people's opinion or, or be, say this negative, to say disrespectful things. Just people that like, some, that like something that, or that's different from your opinion. Because guess what? I'm going to lash out back at you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you off, so I'm not gonna sit there quietly and just accept. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you off. So I'll be surprised if, if they answer back brutally. You know, what I'm saying, you know, if you know, and it's just a classical saying. You have nothing nice. To, if you have nothing nice to say, don't say it at all. What goes around comes around. So if, if, you, if you just keep attacking people, doing this shit, um, it's gonna come out back in the ass. And these people need to stop fucking with people's websites and doing that shit. Because one of these days, guys. Someone's gonna, um, so, someone's gonna fuck with you, and you're not gonna like it. So, in the, the day, calm your shit. It's just opinions. If you, if, do what I do. Ignore it. Like for Suicide Squad, Batman vs Superman, they were wailing on this movie. But you know what I did? I ju I, I, I said, you know what? I'm gonna see if and judge it for myself. And I love both of them. So, 
It doesn't matter. I know there's people that don't like Sonic Adventure 2. I made a counter video saying how it's a great game and, and how you should it should be enjoyed. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, I just, you know, for example, I disagree with Peter, but Pro Jared, uh, you know, not Peter, but I disagree with Pro Jared on his stance of Sonic Adventure 2. I, I, I disagree. I think it's a great game and he's dead wrong, but I'm not, I'm not going to wish him death or take down his website. It's, it's just, it's just an opinion. And they, and they, isn't it more interesting that we have different opinions? Because it will be a boring world if everyone agreed on the same, upon the same thing. It'd just be boring and predictable. It's kind of unique having different opinions and hearing their take on why they like this or why they hate they or why they hate that. It makes for great conversations. Hell, you can maybe maybe change their mind to maybe not maybe not love it, but at least understand why you love it. You know. And then, guys, it's just a game. Calm your shit and just play it. That's all I'm asking. Just play the game. And if you, have, if, you if you disagree with someone, that's fine. But keep it respectful. Don't de give them death threats or take down their, their websites because just because your opinion is different from them. Because you're, you're being a because just well, excuse me just because your opinion is different from them. That's being a communist. That's what you're fucking doing. You're being a communist. You know what I'm saying? It's freedom of speech, man. If you don't like it, ignore it and move on with your life. That's, 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 that's how life is. You know? This shit I see all, all the time that pisses me off. But I just gotta just roll with the punches and move on. This is how life is. Life, I hate to break it to you guys, but life ain't all sunshines and rainbows. <laughs> that's for goddamn sure. So, just grow up. Alright, guys. That's my my thoughts on the matter, guys. Told what you guys think. Have you have you heard have you heard any can you other places that um they got attacked or got negative they got or have, have do you know anybody that didn't like the game and got attacked for saying their opinion? I love you guys. Give you guys. I love to hear you guys. I really love to hear you guys thoughts on the matter. I really do. I think it's a very interesting topic. What do you think about the whole situation? Do you think it's right? Do you think it's wrong? You know my opinion. I think it's just stupid. But that's my thoughts on the matter, guys. And they. The game's great. Just play it. Stop threatening people and taking down sites because of different opinions. It's like a damn, like a, it makes you like a damn crybaby. It's all it does. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. I like to hear, I like to hear your thoughts on the matter. Please make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, this is Rocket Blade signing out. Hope to see you guys again real soon. Peace out, guys.